At first sight, the man you're about to meet appears as a knight in shining armor. He offers hope to people desperate to have babies, but it's not long before he starts to lose his gloss. A clue is the name he goes by. Joe Doner travels the world impregnating any woman who'll have him any way they'll have him. And his proud boast is he's already fathered more than 100 children. Australia is his latest stopover, but instead of welcoming his helping hand, fertility experts here warn that Joe Doner is a dangerous public health risk with very questionable motives. Basically only having sex to get women pregnant. His life's work is to get as many women pregnant as he possibly can. You see, when the footballs overheat, it means the swimming men actually don't survive. So, essentially, their DNA is keeping the human race going. Always wear shorts. We're taught from a young age to like give men sex. Like men, it's a need, they need it. Keep them from cheating on you. You have to give it to them, all this stuff. And then you enter relationships at 18, 19, 20, and the men don't meet your needs. American women are struggling to find American husbands. And there is there is a good reason. The laws in this country are not to benefit American men in marriage. So if a man was concerned about his assets or his future... How would a man be able to judge if his offspring was his or if he had been cuckolded and his wife had slept with somebody else, had their offspring, and now this man is raising offspring unwittingly, which is not his own? 